We have learned that Bethany Frankel's significant other Dennis Shields was at Trump Tower when the massive fire broke out yesterday. As you may be aware, the blaze was so bad that one resident was killed and a few more injured. Apparently, the Real Housewives of New York star's banker boyfriend was lucky enough to get a phone call from Donald Trump's lawyer Michael Cohen, telling him to leave the high-rise building as soon as possible. Frankel is yet to acknowledge the horrible disaster on social media. As for her romance with the banker, the two have been going pretty strong. Back in March, the reality TV star admitted she was head over heels with S.H.I.E.L.D. In addition, we have also heard that he really wants to marry Frankel. Shields lives on the 42nd floor of Trump's building, and he revealed that the presidential attorney is someone he grew up with so they are quite close. Therefore, Cohen called him, he said, are you in the building? I said, yes. He said, you better get out ASAP. That is how I knew to get out, otherwise, I would still be in there. You could smell the smoke, and you could hear things falling through the vents. It just smelled like sulfur, Frankel's man said. He also claimed there was not an official order to evacuate the building. Some of the residents chose to self-evacuate, but sadly, not everybody made it out safely. A friend of the iconic Andy Warhol and art dealer Todd Bresner passed away at the age of 67 because of the fire. He was in his 50C apartment where the fire started. Although Bresner was rushed to the hospital, he did not make it.